What's up everybody? Today in this video we are going to be covering the new release dates for the MCU as well as the DC Universe. We know that uh, due to the pandemic most of the entertainment had to stay on hold and most of these movies uh, some of them were TBDs, some of them now have a fixed date. So we're going to start with the MCU. Let's have a look. The first one is Black Widow. Black Widow is coming out November 6, 2020. So this is the only MCU movie this year. That's it. Then we need to wait until 2021 to see The Eternals. So The Eternals, the new release date will be February 12th. 2021 following by shang chi and the legend of the ten rings so that is on may 7th 2021 so in 2022 it's looking a little bit more like the regular mcu calendar so we have thor love and thunder february 11th 2022 so this is coming a little bit earlier because i think it was later in that year and then we're followed by doctor strange in the multiverse of madness march 25th 2022 gosh we're gonna have to wait a lot to watch this film i am so excited for doctor strange i mean i'm actually excited for thor as well because i really like thor uh and I don't know what's going to happen, but I feel like Doctor Strange and the Multiverse of Madness will be that kind of film that will give us a lot of cameos, you know, and a lot of like, uh, I'm feeling like we're going to see so many characters. I can't wait. I think it's going to be super excited, but we have to wait until 2022. Then followed by Black Panther 2. So that's May 6th, 2022. Captain Marvel 2, which I don't really care, uh, July 8th, 2022. And then there is an untitled Marvel in October 7th, 2022. So we still don't know what this is. Now, before I head over to the DC updates, I cannot forget to mention Spider-Man, Morbius, and Venom. They are all Sony productions. Uh, we know that Spider-Man is still part of the MCU. And we don't really know the connection of Morbius and Venom uh, within the MCU, but Spider-Man might pop in in this film as a cameo we're all hoping right so these are the new release dates so first is morbius coming out in march 19th 2021 then followed by venom in the summer june 25th 2021 and the last one is spider-man 3 november 5th 2021 so the spider-man 5 far from home sequel and uh there's still no name venom we already have a name it's going to be called let there be carnage let me know in the comments below what do you think so those are the latest updates from the sony productions that are also related to Marvel because they are Marvel characters, but they belong to Sony. Anyways, DC now. Here is the DC film. So the first one we will have this year and only one is Wonder Woman. So Wonder Woman is coming out on August 14th and I'm super excited for that. I think it's going to be a massive, huge film. I'm just a little bit concerned that August, it's still too soon. You know, I really wish and I really want this movie to do well, uh, but we don't know how this world pandemic will be. By August, hopefully people are back to their normal lives and everyone is not scared to go in the theater on the, in the fall following year we have Suicide Squad 2 so that's the James Gunn film and this is going to be a year later that's crazy you know look at the date here August 6 2021 my goodness we're gonna have to wait a long time and then we are also going to have in October the following year which I think is actually a brilliant date, the Batman. Uh, and the reason why I think this is really good is because the Joker did so well and came out in October. And uh, I think October is a perfect month for having this sort of film, you know? And uh, so, well, October 1st, 2021. So you know this couldn't come any sooner i'm excited to see this film hopefully it'll be a great film following by that we have black adam that is another movie i'm super excited to see so that is featuring the rock and that is coming out in december 20 22nd that is cool it, i think it's a great date uh i can't wait so three films next year for the dc universe then following the on the following year we have The Flash. So The Flash is coming out in June 3rd. It looks like this is going to be the Flashpoint storyline. I think it's a little bit too early to do that. You shouldn't really do such a major story in the first film, but I mean, 
that those are the rumors we still don't know if that's true and that would be like the soft reboot for the universe uh so this is coming out on on june then we have november shazam 2 I'm super excited too. I love the first Shazam. I had a great time with that film. And obviously Shazam 2 will probably feature Black Adam. Hopefully, you know, if Black Adam does well, I think it will. Uh, it can feature Black Adam in Shazam 2. Maybe, hopefully, Superman, Henry Cavill you know uh, and then followed by that we have Aquaman 2 so Aquaman is a December film coming out on the 16th of December 2022 so three movies for the DC Universe in 2022 and three films for the DC Universe in 2021 and one movie this year so this is crazy that we have to wait another whole year to see another DC film uh, this is insane but hopefully this will get more seats on the theaters uh, and hopefully life will go back to normal uh, by August and but the Marvel Universe they are always smarter you know they put their movie all the way the first one in November you know because it's it's safer November than August in my opinion but there you have it guys that is the timeline the new updated timeline for the Marvel Universe uh, up, upcoming films as well as the DC Universe upcoming films let me know in your comments down below which one of these films are you most excited I would love to hear your thoughts and if you enjoyed this video don't forget to hit that thumbs up subscribe for more We'll see you next time. Bye!